These are not sure. lies of ignorance. These are people who know better. And the uh, insurance companies, they, you bet they uh, do. They, they, they know that Medicare has an overhead of about 2%. So if I may make a, a, a small correction on what the gentleman has said, uh, there is waste and fraud in Medicare. Uh, I think the gentleman said a lot. Actually, it's a little. But when there are 44 million beneficiaries, almost 45 million beneficiaries, a little bit of error, a little bit of fraud can add up to a lot of money. Um, but the program itself, if you count administrative costs as well as waste, fraud, and abuse, it's a couple of percent. See, this in other words, almost all the money in Medicare goes to providing health care. But I, ha I have Absolutely to say true. that it's not, just necess it's not necessarily just a, a, a little bit. At the beginning of September, the Department of Health and Human Services and the Department of Justice announced the largest health care fraud settlement in history. Pfizer, the drug company, agreed to pay $2.3 billion for illegal marketing practices. And that is going to return about a billion dollars to Medicare and Medicaid. So that's not, I mean, that's not chump change. On a percentage <laughs> basis, it's a yeah. small amount. Yeah, it's times right. 45 million beneficiaries, and that adds well, up to a lot. No, I, I agree the key point you. here is that in this legislation, there is a specific effort to eliminate the fraud that goes on in the system. You know, the unnecessary payments, the stealing of the Social Security cards, all those kinds of things that are out there. We know we need to deal with that, and we are dealing with it. Not even before this piece of legislation, we put money into the budget to deal with that, and then this legislation strengthens that. So, and in addition to that, we now will have better medical record technology which will also assist us in keeping track of what's going on. It is a small piece of a much, much larger piece of legislation that does help seniors in very, very specific ways.